I like the abuse. Maybe he's a bit of a what, what is it like a sadist or something or like yeah. BDSM. Yeah, he likes the shit. Can you t put me in handcuffs and then tell me more about yeah, how worthless I am? <laughs> Oh, didn't like that. Oh, Nid likes it now. <laughs> you didn't like it, or the no, game didn't like it? The game it. didn't like it. It went crazy. Did you see? Yeah, yeah, I saw that. It's saying, no, 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 stop. Put me back on the other screen. I think it's actually like a little bit of a, a, a tease at the fact that it might not be a, a standard dating game. Oh, it's doing it by itself. Yeah, it's just the thing. It's just a, it's not nothing to do with me clicking around in the menus or anything. Well, yeah, it happened like every single time you click something. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's happening much more frequently than I expected that it would. So you know what's going on here? No, all I know is that this came out of Valentine's Day, and the guy was like, "Hey, who wants to play my uh, little dating game?" And then I saw a comment or two being like, "This is not what I thought it was going to be." In a positive way, people were like interested in what was happening. You check your phone. She's ten minutes late. You're not sure what to do, and discomfort starts to settle in your stomach. What do you think? Sit and wait patiently, take a sip of water, shift uncomfortably. Water. <laughs> you thirsty? Yeah. It's warm. <gasps> She's here. Do you wanna be do you wanna be the mysterious woman? Yeah. <laughs> I think it says hey. Hey. Yeah, hey. <laughs> I'm so sorry yeah, I'm late. Day. Yeah, and <laughs> My car's in the shop and I just had to take the bus here. Well, I understand. It happens to the best of us. I'm sorry. I probably could have come and picked you up. Shit happens. I'll get over it. Yeah, let's be pissy. It was ten whole minutes. Is that how long it took? Yeah. I suppose it does. It's okay. So I'm Karen. I know your friend Rebecca. What's your name? Kevin Gert. <laughs> My name is Sherbert P. Sport North. <laughs> For Stanley. Stanley. Oh, there's more that you can scroll a little bit. I like My Gert. name? Er? Sure, but he has the thing. It's, uh... I do like that. Let's mess with her a little bit. I have no reason to... Oh, this is you. <laughs> I have no reason to doubt your story, Herbert. <laughs> yeah, you're the one who's supposed to be on edge here. You were the yeah. late one. I was on time. You have to believe everything I say for the next, like, five minutes. Tell me, what do you do? I used to work in mobile apps, but I've started trading crypto instead. I push papers for the man, clock in and out, hour lunch break, 9 to 5, kill me. <laughs> Mostly clown around between shifts at a restaurant, not unlike this one. Let's or just be the super depressing downer yeah, we've been... kill me. <laughs> kill me! <laughs> the world is like a huge machine that needs all cogs and gears inside to function. You work for the man, it's not the worst. That's fair, but it doesn't make the job much more tolerable. You call me a machine cog? I think we've already tanked this date. I'm just going to keep committing unless you would like to just, venture just see what happens. Just, I yeah. bet she's a nice girl. She'll understand. <laughs> yeah, if the wing nut fits, <laughs> she's funny. Yeah, yeah, she's very tolerant of what a shitty attitude. Do you think it'd be weird we, if we called we, crabs crumbs? Did we also say continue? <laughs> go <Yeah>. on. <laughs> go on. Continue <laughs> with this date. Uh, crabs, yeah, crumbs? Yeah, do you think it'd be weird if we called crabs crumbs? I mean, couldn't you do that about any two words? That's the point, I think. <laughs> would it be weird if we called chairs tables? The fuck are you talking about, Karen? <laughs> what would we call crumbs? Crabs. Oh, Obviously. so you're just swapping them. You got a bunch of crabs all over the floor. Well, yeah, but then if that became the standard linguistics, then it wouldn't even be weird, would it? <laughs> this is a shitty... A uh, hypothetical situation, Karen. We've got crabs all over your shirt. Are we just commenting on her shitty dress attire now? Hey, or, she looks great. Her hygiene. I heard there was a mass escape of crumbs at the zoo. Somebody let them all loose. Oh my, what cute hermit crumbs. Now let's make fun of her dirty shirt. <laughs> Karen shifts <laughs> uncomfortably for a moment. You seem nervous. Are you okay? <laughs> Sherbert? <laughs> Sher Sherbert Herbert P. Burbertson, I think my name was. I'll admit, I'm just a little bit. I, it's been a very long time since I've been out. Longer still since I've been on a date. I was at first, but I feel a little better now. Not really. You seem more bothered than I am. <laughs> oh, sorry for being presumptuous then. Maybe I'm showing my hand. Show me your other hand. Show me both your hands. And then she does a magic trick. Yeah. She pulls a rose. I'm only going to keep one hand above the table, though. You don't get to know what my other hand's doing <laughs> over there. Touching those cool jeans. 
Are those jeans? I think so. They look like weird, I think stretchy Ed, I think leather. Ed Hardy jeans. Yeah. <laughs> so where are you from, P. Herbert? From womb to tomb. <laughs> I've been living in this city my whole life. <laughs> I've never heard that before. That's really funny. I moved here when I was a kid. Don't remember much of where I used to live. You could say I'm still a tourist. Moved here a few months ago. Womb to tomb yeah, is that's, too that's funny. Cool. <laughs> really, me too. I love the skyscrapers, the ocean, everything about this place. I'd say it's probably one of the best places to live in sounds like you've had a lot of good experiences i'm rather indifferent to it actually i could stay or go wow and here i think this city city's a trap i've been trying to get out of here since high school which one of these is more depressing what's the first one the first one was like mm. eh, it's positive oh it's you're glad you've enjoyed your time but also it could mean like i haven't had good experiences like lucky you having all these good experiences true I feel like it's it's too not, positive. Not that tone. Yeah, I'm not trying. Tone to, we're going for. I'm trying to set the bar low so that the second date just looks like a looks like you a really miracle. Get her on the second one. <laughs> yeah, she'll for sure. Yeah, you say yes to a follow up. I'm rather indifferent. Uh, I could stay or go. Why is that? It's just a place to live for me. Nothing beyond that. I don't have much tying me down here. I thought he was gonna say like I don't have much to live for. <laughs> Uh, just a place to live. I can understand that. Home is where the heart is, and where yours seems to be missing. Ooh, burn. Didn't you hear? I've literally never left this city. There's no other place my heart could be. I think you're missing a heart. So, who was your last lover? I want to know. <laughs> I'm trying to think of, like, her Bertha, sure Bertha. We had very similar names. It was a it was a great point of contention between us. We didn't know who, which last name we were going to take or anything. It was going to be very confusing for the kids. It seems a little inappropriate. I'd prefer to keep that to myself. We'll just say excuse me. You heard me. Who was the last woman you slept with? <laughs> it was a really unsatisfying like slam slam on the thing. Much less impactful than a table slam or whatever. It doesn't that weird ta chair rattle it made. <laughs> uh, I don't feel particularly comfortable answering that. Oh, like thousands of women. I was sleeping with <laughs> women ten minutes before you got here. <laughs> that woman behind me, that blonde-haired woman? It's her. <laughs> Banged her last night. <laughs> well, we don't get to see who she's at a date with. Also, what's going on on her table there? That would be a crumb. Okay. <laughs> I'll take your word for it. You have a better angle on it. I'm facing the other direction. <laughs> it's been a long time. If really that's if it's that important, I, it's the only two. Karen releases an apologetic sigh. <sighs> that's is that apologetic? I don't think so. Well, it was some sort of sigh. I'm Even sorry. Though. That was rude of me. Like I said, it's been a while since I've gone on a date, and I'm not very good at interacting anymore. I'll, I'll read between the lines of your sigh. Ha 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 ha! I understand. Or what's that? What's the guy from the tr Toronto? Raptors, Kawhi, oh, Kawhi Leonard. Leonard. Yeah, did you did you see his awkward laugh? His thing? laugh is pretty bad. I want to. I want that to be the <laughs> awkward <laughs> laugh. Is like, huh? <laughs> that's my brother's favorite video. He made me watch it like fourteen times. <laughs> I understand. I've been out of commission for a while too. Uh, yeah, sure. No, I want the awkward laugh in there. Dang. Thank you. Some weird response. Thank you for understanding. I really appreciate you taking me out. This is a very nice restaurant. I was reading the reviews on the way over. No, I'm just here because of a Groupon. <laughs> <laughs> View is really cool. This place was really the only place I could find that wasn't full on a night like this. That's fortunate for us, I suppose. Seems like a really nice place. I like how the posture has never changed. She has no. Saved... She, her hand has moved. Oh, really? Yeah, it's moved up and down because it was touching the glass before. Oh, is she like showing us She's... the level of interest in the date? She raises and lowers it. Like, yeah, we've been a little nicer Ooh, to you're her. You're somewhere up at a seven right now. It's a. You started I'll, at a three. I'll let you know as you start dropping off. I was just thinking she looked interested and we looked bored as hell the entire time. We look kind of dreamy. Ooh. Or like we're dreaming. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Continue. So, uh, seen any good shows lately? Been watching a lot of nature documentaries. I like to watch uh, old tapes of Hitler and other dictator speeches. I'm like I honestly spend more time on my phone than I do looking up at the screen. You just swapping screens, screens, man. Yeah, don't even finish a sentence. You like what? Mumbly grumbles, murmurs and mumbles, murmured mumbles. 
What? Anime, it's anime. <laughs> now I understand. Anime, what a shame. Rushing over to school to catch the next episode of Poyo Mecha X was my everything growing up. Oh, why the same shame? I thought she was saying, what a shame. This date is clearly a dead. A lot of people don't really get it. I don't know, it's getting more and more accepted everywhere. Even my grandma knows what anime is. Oh yeah, maybe. Maybe your grandma's just too cool. Oh yeah, ask grandma on date. Oh yeah, let's see if we can transition this. Like George trying, or Jerry trying to date the, the roommate or whatever. In Seinfeld. Oh, yep. Yep. yeah, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna do that, but we're gonna do the switcheroo where we date the and grandma. I, I believe that the solution that they eventually came up to was to propose a three way, <laughs> and then he was just like, "She'll be flattered to be included. She'll be embarrassed by it." And like that was their plan for dating the roommate. Um, that's how we're gonna date her grandmas. We're gonna suggest three -way. a three way. Karen fidgets uncomfortably. What's up? So how's Cassandra doing, by the way? Who's Cassandra? I think her uh, grandma? grandma might be dead. Either that or she just loves anime so much that it's embarrassing. Oh, I don't want to... Or she, or she knows her grandma's a fox and that she's going to lose us to her grandma. Hopefully that one. I think Cassandra is the mutual friend who said No, it's Rebecca. Oh, shit. Good memory. <laughs> who? Uh, how do you know that name? <laughs> Turn into Batman for a second. How do you know that name? <laughs> Do you seriously not remember your own mother's name? What? I do, but you're starting to freak me out. No, wait, the question is actually, how do you know her name? And I'm getting wafts of a serial killer vibe. Um, second one. Second one seems good, yeah. Karen pauses for a moment. <gasps> Had you not mentioned her before? I don't recall it. Oh, Karen, the serial killer. She thinks, <laughs> not up word. I'm so sorry, my friend at work mentioned her. Apparently she used to work for the company, and, and I thought you'd said it. I suppose that makes sense. Uh, it's no big deal, I won't think any more into it. Oh, yeah, you're gonna die. Weird coincidence. We're, we're dead. Do you think? Are oh, we yeah. in a simulation? Are we yeah. talking to a robot right now? No, a she's murderous a... murderous robot? She's a murderous human. It is a human still, you think, hey? It's like getting wires crossed in your head. I feel a little, a little dumb now. Wires. Wires, because she's a robot, oh, She's man. a robot. Fine, you're right. Is, is that enough arguments? Did yeah. I make a compelling yeah. argument? <laughs> wires, robots, done. Why are you here? I'm, what? What just happened there? What the fuck just happened to her face? Oh, no. We're in a simulation. It's disintegrating around us. Okay, well, I'm glad I noticed the hole in the table back when I did. <laughs> so I noticed okay, something. so it's not a crumb. Something like fell past yeah, the screen. Yeah, I saw that there. too. Uh, I've been trying to have a nice date. I'm really beginning to question that. You mean like existentially? Yeah. <laughs> sort of, but not really. Then what do you mean? Why are you here on this date? What made you come here today? Okay, seriously, what's your problem? I'm at a loss for words. I'm sick of this. I'm leaving. No, you're not leaving. No, I'm hanging you're... in. Hanging yeah. in there. Uh, I'm Second one. At a loss. You've been living here alone for nearly three years now. That's Wound a long to time to be alone with your thoughts. Three-year-old baby here on a date. <laughs> what does your, what does the voice sound like? The one that eats away, <laughs> away every day of your miserable existence. What the hell is wrong with you? You thought you were being a dick. Yeah, I was trying to be an asshole the entire date. I was going to bang her grandma, and now all of a sudden she's shattering my reality. Come God, on. you're pathetic. The way you drink, the way you sleep, your disgusting habits when you think nobody's watching. Come on, oh, knock she's... it off. Oh, it's breaking more. Oh my god, her face is... Oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh, all of it's gone. Oh no. I could see you shaking all the way from the entrance. Did you really think someone would actually want to come and meet you? I wasn't... Sherbert, I... Sherbert? I... <laughs> <laughs> well, they would want to meet me by the name alone, but once you get to know me, I really don't live up to the name. <laughs> Please stop. I just don't want to be alone anymore. I can't handle it. Nah, if I can just stop. Oh. You will always be alone, no matter what you t what you try and do about it. Do you really think anybody could ever reasonably love you? I don't deserve to be treated like this. I can dish it, but I can't take it. But you do. You have nothing of value to offer to anyone, and the only the only way anyone would love you is if they treat you like I'm treating you now. You're a pile of human garbage, a reject, mm. thrown out and cast aside as you rightfully should be. Go on. <laughs> Continue. Oh, no. Oh, shit. You hate yourself oh. and hurt everyone around you, and yet you feel like you're, you owed the right to be lonely? Is what we thought was something falling? Was it like I the building disappearing and reappearing so. or something? Okay. 
Uh, shut up, 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 shut up. <laughs> I can't take it. I just feel so empty inside. Nah, just don't face the reality. Just tell her to shut up. You've been dead inside for years. Maybe even your whole life. I've seen you eyeing up the pills in your medicine cabinet, and every time your cowardice wins out. Jesus. I need help. I need to be loved. I need to get out of here. I just want love. Oh. Well, you need to realize just how insignificant you are in the grand scheme of your own life and how feebly your voice resonates. You see the spooky eyes oh over my here? Oh god, Ooh. I don't like this at all. You're fucking insane! <laughs> Clearly we're not insane. It's, this is all Karen. She's just projecting her own insecurities. <laughs> no more insane than you, and no matter how crazy I am, you're still a whiny little squirt who only exists to bog others down with your problems and continually achingly lonely. Please, I'm begging you, stop saying these things. Why are you even saying these things? Can I get your grandma's number? <laughs> I don't even know why I came here. I'm sorry. I know I sound angry. And I am. <laughs> oh, fake but, out. <laughs> but it's not because I hate you. I just hate looking into your eyes and only seeing pain day in and day out. You're hollow. You're on a blind date and you should be happy to be here. To be happy to talk to me and yet you look so hollow. I just want to be loved, accepted, or happy. Oh, uh, she doesn't want every single one. I don't know if the buttons on the keyboard work, but I'm going to hit all three at the same time, and I don't know which one it's going to choose. So I don't know which one I picked. We want all of them. <laughs> we all want something, one of those three things. But unfortunately, <laughs> you don't deserve that. This was a mistake. You shouldn't have come here. You should have stayed home, ordered a pizza. No reason to take this abuse from me. Do you want to order a pizza? Yeah. <laughs> I could never fix everything that's fucked up about you anyway. You can! Just marry me! Be my wife! <laughs> That'll fix all of our problems. We'll have, like, the stories for our kids! We'll have a cat and like six kids. We'll tell it out across like nine seasons and in the end we'll reveal that it was all about trying to bang our aunt rather than- or your aunt. Your Grandma. kid's aunt. Yeah, it'll, it'll be- that'll be our version There's also of, an aunt? That'll be our version of How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> is that the whole time was getting the kids permission to bang the grandma. <laughs> but you can, but you should, but you won't. I never will. I'm not gonna just magically fix your problems. If anything, I'd make them worse. I'm not the solution, I'm the problem. You're the problem. You get in the way of your own happiness. You are my obsession. I've followed you your whole life. I've never seen someone so unhappy. I'm so unclear, because like, if this is a, a robot or a simulation or whatever, why was I being followed so closely and everything? Like, I don't really understand. I don't is understand it, anything. Is my own brain projecting Karen? Is Karen actually just me? You think so. Or us? I don't know. I think Karen is you. So Karen what do I do Herbert now? Sherbert. <laughs> we all all We're Herbert all Sherbert. Herbert Sherbert. <laughs> be a good episode title, right? We are all Herbert Sherbert. How can people resist clicking Black, on Black that? Black Mirror, season five. <laughs> right. <laughs> Uh, why do I do this to myself? What do I do now is, is, I think, a big question. I honestly don't know that answer. That's something you'll have to figure out alone. You're not fit for a relationship. You shouldn't have to rely on a blind date to be here. You should be able to meet people on your own. You shouldn't have come here. God, you're a mess. None of this should have happened. I'd say I've made things worse, but you're already a mental wreck before you walked in here. That's just what I am. Why would you know that? I'm sorry? Now why we're gonna you, start apologizing? Why would you know that? Oh, don't be so spineless, Herbert. Don't apologize. You do anything Why wrong. would you know that? Uh, I'm gonna go back to using the mouse, because then people can more clearly see mm. what I'm choosing. It hardly matters. You need to realize that nothing is going to change, that a girl isn't going to change anything. One may come into your life every once in a while, but you'll just be back where you are now. The underlying problem never gets fixed. Does it ever end? Will it ever get better? Will I ever find love? I feel like we're talking in cycles. She shits on us in a whole bunch, and then Herbert's all like, why? And then she love, shits on us a bunch. Love me, Karen. <laughs> Does Will, will it get better? No, it doesn't. Fuck. <laughs> you lead a barren, desolate life. Does this scare you? Does it terrify you? Because it should. You are alone. Completely, utterly worthless. You shouldn't have come. Your life is just going to be one endless stream of misery that only ends in your inevitable death. I mean, everyone inevitably dies. Some that doesn't. People, most people aren't as lonely as you, though. No, that's true. I guess maybe it is a bit more of a stronger punctuation on the sentence than it normally would be. Faced with all this, with your loneliness, with this abuse, what are you going to do now? I'm gonna stay. 
I like the abuse. Maybe he's a bit of a what, what is it like a sadist or something or like yeah. BDSM. Yeah, he likes the shit. Can you t put me in handcuffs and then tell me more about yeah, how worthless I am? <laughs> I'm gonna stay. Here. Oh. What you're saying isn't anything I haven't told myself a thousand times. Keep going, I like the abuse, yes! I'm not trying to turn you on. <laughs> it's working. I want to help you. I want you to recognize this, this horrible thing you are. I've been thinking the whole time that you're just awful at flirting. <laughs> I know what I am. You're close, but close isn't right. Uh, yeah, I just thought you were shitty at flirting. If you don't mind my boldness, then tell me. What do you dislike the most about yourself? I'm not good at anything. I don't know what to do with my life. I never finish anything I start. Hmm. Two? I don't... I, yeah, I don't know how to answer and that. And... Not as more. far as I could be. If I tried harder, I wish I had more motivation. I feel so left behind. But I could have tried harder, I guess. Mm -hmm. When you tell me I'm worthless, you're preaching to the choir. Might as well be talking to myself. Karen smiles. Karen's smile is grim. Yes, yeah, that was she a thinks. weird sentence to... <laughs> she, she, she's but she's she thinking, oh, my grim smile. <laughs> I sure hope this smile looks grim. I wish I had a mirror right now, so <laughs> I hope this face that I'm making looks how I'm picturing it. <laughs> hmm? Uh, I never left my apartment, did I? You're very nervous. Your shirt's soaked. In sweat, I hope. Oh, look at all that's tearing apart in the background now, oh, too. Oh, no, I don't like that. <laughs> oh, no. But. Oh, no. But I want to add another T in there, maybe. Karen waits for you to finish. Oh, so we are banging. No, <laughs> that's not what she's waiting for. It's turning Every, into your apartment. Everything you said to me. Do you really think she's going to grill you like this? Is this normal? Why would you dislike... Why would she dislike you? She doesn't even know you. Oh, so are we running ourselves through a simulated date? Yeah. Because I deserve it? Because I like it. You know that's not true. This doesn't feel right to you. I guess. I think you know this isn't right. I think you know that these thoughts are all your own. The pain is real. But is anything else? At what point are you holding yourself down because you're afraid to get up? Man, this game got real deep and real real well also, real. While also being fake oh look you did order pizza <laughs> i think you're right i'm afraid but why shouldn't i be her opinion has to matter because if it didn't what's the point i don't want to be afraid what do i have to lose yeah the opinion one we all have to work on balancing acts we see ourselves through the eyes of others whether we're as tall as giants or as small as insects finding your own self worth is difficult but not impossible what do you recommend baby steps Come back into a baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, start. you're only three years old. Let's start with this date. She might be amazing and she might not be. You're going to decide that when you get there, and she's going to get the chance to make the same choice about you. Sounds good? Okay, sure, I can try that. Come on, goofball. You're late for the date. Oh, more mean comments. She crossed the line. You can call me worthless and, and an asshole all day, but goofball. goofball. I try real hard to put on a serious exterior. And I bet Karen's his cat. Shattered that. Achievement unlocked imagination. imagination. Karen's the cat. Yeah, Karen's the cat. <laughs> there, I did see a thing in, the, in this screen down in this corner. One out of 14 what? endings discovered. Yeah, I don't plan to play the game enough for 14 endings, but, like, that is pretty cool that there's that much branching possibilities in there. What is the name of the restaurant? Le... Nu... Le... P-N-U... Crave? Crave. I don't know. It's... What does P... Some foreign language. It's French. <laughs> Unheard of language. <laughs> I bet it means something cryptic. I would be. I w would actually be curious if it like applies in some way. C R E V E. Yeah. Translate. <laughs> yeah, I think I got it right. Translate. The flat tire. <laughs> <laughs> That's not at all what I expected. Nope. I don't really see it, like what the the connection what a, is there. What a whatever. Twist, then. <laughs> That's, twist ending there. I do. Maybe it's the joke on the fact that like. It, you can put anything in French, and you're like, ooh, fancy, and then you get a flat tire. Yeah, flat tire. That's pretty funny. Well, that was a neat one. Thanks to the dev for sending that our way. Yeah, that was... I uh, personally am not going to invest on camera 14 or, like, 30 attempts at finding 14 endings, but I might play around with it more on my own. I was sad that I had to be the... The bitch? The bitch, the bitch. yeah, it sucked. She was really mean. I'm sorry. It's it hurt you. No, it was what I wanted. I, I needed that. It almost got Herbert Sherbert to 
to go off there, like sexually. We almost got him. <laughs> He's yeah, pretty he, close. He never finishes anything he starts, though. <laughs> I wonder if like there's any ending where it's not. Uh, like where it's an actual date, I or I bet you there. Yeah, I bet you there are ones where it's either it turns out it's actually a date, or where you choose to live in the simulation, or like there's probably ones where you do just like successfully like land a second date or whatever. I don't know, fourteen different endings. There's all sorts of shit that could happen. I hope one he dies. Twist. Probably, Bandersnatch, man. There's all kinds of shit going on. 